Welcome to the introduction on algorithm complexity, where you'll learn to evaluate and choose the right algorithms effectively. Diving right into the heart of algorithm complexity, it's essential to grasp how this concept plays a pivotal role in the scalability and efficiency of applications we use daily, like Google Maps. Algorithm complexity allows us to predict how an algorithm performs as data volume grows, highlighting the necessity for efficient algorithms in technology. Big O notation, an integral part of this analysis, categorizes algorithms by their worst case scenario, offering a simplified view of their scalability. For example, O1 represents constant complexity, unaffected by input size, whereas ON and ON square depict linear and quadratic complexities, demonstrating how execution time increases with data volume. This foundational understanding is crucial for optimizing applications to be both fast and resource efficient, ensuring technologies like Google Maps can deliver route optimizations swiftly and effectively. Understanding algorithm complexity is essential for optimizing algorithm performance, particularly in data-heavy fields like data science. It measures how an algorithm's execution time or memory needs increase with input size. For example, comparing bubble sorts on squared complexity to quick sorts on log n shows the dramatic impact of algorithm selection on performance. Bubble sort becomes inefficient for large datasets due to its quadratic time increase, whereas quick sort is more scalable. This highlights the importance of analyzing algorithm complexity to choose the most efficient algorithms and the role efficient data structures play in further optimizing performance. The key to effective software development lies in understanding the scalability of algorithms through big O notation. Choosing an efficient algorithm like quick sort over bubble sort dramatically enhances performance, especially with large data volumes. Quicksort's O log of n complexity maintains efficiency as data grows, unlike bubble sort's O of n squared, which quickly becomes impractical. Furthermore, profiling tools play a critical role in this process, offering empirical evidence on algorithm performance. They help verify theoretical efficiency claims, ensuring that applications remain responsive regardless of data size or complexity. This proves that theoretical knowledge, paired with empirical testing, guides optimal algorithm selection. Big O notation serves as a fundamental tool in computing to characterize the performance of algorithms, particularly focusing on their worst case scenario. This notation is pivotal for predicting how an algorithm's execution time or space requirements will grow with the size of the input data. Understanding this will equip you with the ability to select the appropriate algorithm that ensures efficiency and effectiveness across varying computing tasks. Consider the time complexities. Constant time O1 might be seen in accessing any element by index in an array. Logarithmic time O log n can be exemplified by binary search, where each step cuts the search space in half. Linear time O n is observed in algorithms that examine each input element individually, such as finding the maximum value in an unsorted list. Quadratic time, O n squared, becomes evident in nested loops, common in algorithms like bubble sort, where each element is compared in pairs to sort the array. These examples underscore the practical implications of choosing the right complexity for algorithms, directly affecting their performance and scalability. When tackling efficiency in software systems, understanding constant time complexity, denoted as O1, is essential. Operations like accessing an element in an array by index or utilizing a hash table with perfect hashing encapsulate this concept. These examples, notable for their independence from input size, are crucial for developing applications that maintain performance regardless of data volume. However, it's important to note the assumption of perfect hashing and the potential for hash collisions, underscoring the need for careful data structure selection. This insight into constant time complexity 
not only highlights its role in optimizing algorithm performance, but also in ensuring scalability and responsiveness in data-intensive applications. Logarithmic time complexity, symbolized as O log of n, highlights a pivotal efficiency shift, notably through binary search. This method halves the search area each time, thereby slashing the operations needed to find an element within a sorted array. Such efficiency is not just theoretical. Binary search is integral to improving database query speeds and streamlining directory searching. By harnessing O log of n complexity, these practical applications become vastly more efficient, underscoring the real-world value of understanding and applying such an algorithm. This illustrates the tangible benefits of logarithmic time in optimizing search processes. Linear time complexity, designated as ON, directly impacts algorithm performance with large datasets. The findMax function, shown iterates through an array once to find the maximum value, highlighting how operation count scales with array size. This example not only demonstrates linear complexity in action, but also underlines the importance of recognizing such patterns for algorithm optimization. Efficiently managing growing data volumes hinges on understanding this direct relationship between input size and execution time, a critical skill for developing scalable and efficient applications. The key to optimizing software performance lies in selecting efficient algorithms, particularly for large datasets. When employing algorithms with quadratic time complexity, like bubble sort, the execution time increases quadratically as the input size grows. This illustrates the inefficiency of such algorithms for processing substantial amounts of data, making them less suitable for large datasets. Conversely, algorithms like quick sort or merge sort which generally operate at ON log of N average time complexity, offer substantial performance improvements. This distinction underlines the importance of understanding algorithmic complexities to ensure the scalability and efficiency of applications, highlighting the critical role of algorithm selection in software development. Exponential time complexity is a crucial concept especially illustrated through the O2N notation. This is where, with each additional piece of input, computation time doubles, showcasing a severe impact on scalability. An evident example is the naive Fibonacci calculation method, where the absence of optimization leads to repeated unnecessary calculations, dramatically increasing execution time. To counteract this inefficiency, dynamic programming offers a robust solution. By decomposing the problem and storing interim results, it dramatically reduces computational efforts, transforming the approach to Fibonacci from an impractical, exponential time complexity to a feasible one. This highlights the significance of algorithm selection in managing computational resources efficiently. When solving for efficiency, Understanding code complexity is paramount. Take, for instance, the factorial eta and factorial rec methods for calculating factorials. The former employs an iterative process, straightforward but possibly less efficient for large inputs. In contrast, the recursive factorial rec appears cleaner, but can be tricky for novices and inefficient without optimization. Moreover, Selecting appropriate data structures greatly influences code's complexity. Searching within a list exemplifies O-N linear time complexity, as each element might need examination. Conversely, dictionaries enable O-1 search times, showcasing hash table efficiency. This distinction emphasizes not just code efficiency, but the critical role of structure and method selection. Big O notation is critical for algorithm analysis because it provides a benchmark for algorithm performance under the most demanding scenarios. By understanding how algorithms scale with increasing data sizes, developers can make informed decisions that ensure applications remain robust and responsive, even under extreme conditions. Dynamic programming transforms the approach to solving complex problems 
such as the Fibonacci sequence, by converting an exponential time complexity problem into a more manageable linear time complexity one. By storing the results of subproblems and reusing them, it prevents redundant calculations, leading to much more efficient algorithms. This technique exemplifies the powerful impact of strategic algorithm selection and optimization on computational efficiency.